Hello and welcome to Great Prime TV. Here we bring you scripture-based prayers. Psalm 102 verse 13 says, Thou shalt arise and have mercy upon Zion. The time to favor her. Yea, the set time is come. Why is it the set time to favor her? Why? Because Zion have discovered a potent way to assess God. And what is that potent way? It is assessing God by his words. Is assessing God by his word. First John 4 says, And this is the confidence that we have in him, that once we ask him of anything according to his will, he heareth us. According to his will. And his will is the scriptures. We hear we pray scriptural prayers. The Bible also says that heaven and earth will pass away, but my word will not pass away. What is his word? His word is that his will. So when we go to the scriptures, we get scriptures based on what we want God to do for us. We pray those scriptures here in this channel. We pray those scriptures and we see God doing wonders in our life. And we see God changing us. And we see God making us love him the more. And we see ourselves getting closer to God. Join us in this prayer and see answers to your prayers. And get answers to your prayer. Say to the righteous, it shall be well with them. For they shall eat the fruit of their doings. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. You will pray that prayer loud and clear. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor in the name of Jesus I shall eat the fruit of my labor in the name of Jesus I shall eat the fruit of my neighbor say my father my father shout it loud and clear shout it loud and clear in the name of Jesus as I begin to pray I shall eat the fruit of my labor in the name of Jesus as I begin to pray I shall eat the fruit of my labor I eat the fruit of my labor. 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 I eat the fruit of
Connect your faith to my faith. I, I connect. connect. I see a mighty harvest coming for your family. I see families that were despised suddenly become lifted. Suddenly becoming the center of attraction, the signature of all eyes. I see your family celebrating in pomp and pageantry. I see a massive celebration coming for your family. 
you that was not called the people shall be called the people of the living God. I see house number 14. And God says that house celebration is coming. The hand of God is coming upon everyone under the sound of my voice. It is well with your household. It is well with your children. It is well with your siblings. Well with your spouse. I decree they shall eat the fruit of their labor. Begin to eat the fruit of your labor. Your children begin to eat the fruit of their labor. I decree that you will not struggle for others to enjoy. You will not plant for others to invest. You will not sow for others to reap. You will eat the fruit of your labor. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. To you mother who is holding your breast, I see you. God says, I should tell you concerning your children, you will eat the fruit of your labor. To you father, you will eat the fruit of your labor. To you that went to school and you have no job, you will eat the fruit of your labor. Receive a visitation now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I see somebody in your church, you are into the media. I just saw you. And the Lord is saying that there have been so much troubles in your personal life. God says, I should tell you, that in the next 72 hours, a turnaround is coming. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Somebody, a serpent has been programmed into your house to attack you. A serpent. You wake up in the next 24 hours and meet the serpent dead in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Jude. Jude. God says, I should pray for Jude. God says, Jude is wiping your tears. Heaven is wiping your tears. God is wiping your tears. God is wiping your tears. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Somebody is wearing a shirt. The whole top is black, but it's had an open button here. But it's pink. But the top most is crested black. It has an open button, but it's pink. And the Lord is showing me something that has been happening to your wife. He said the attack of the enemy on her ends today. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. So a lady in South America who has two children who have been booked for an operation. The Lord healed them now. I decree it is well with you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. So shall it be. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. You are sick in body. Put your left hand where you are ailing and hurting. Malade, votre main gauche, and stretch your other hand towards me. me vers moi, I command. Je command you devil of sickness. Toi maladie, spirit of infirmity. Infirmity, demon of attack. Demon attack. Come out in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Jesus. I decree be made whole. Soyez guéri complètement. From the crowns of your hair to the soles de la of your tête feet. Pied. Jesus heal you. Jesus will guéri. Jesus make you whole. Jesus will guéri complètement. Jesus touch you. Jesus will touch. Jesus set you free. Jesus will liberate. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Dans le Amen. Nom de Jesus. It is well with you. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. The Lord bless you and the Lord grant your desires. In Jesus, let's take our own. My time has come. Amen. My time for favor has come. Amen. My time for honor has come. Amen. My time for celebration has come. Amen. And I believe God with you today in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Spirit, that everything you need that makes for life and godliness shall be granted to you in the name of Jesus. Amen. I believe God with you that whatever is a desire of your heart. As we call upon the God that answers by fire, the God that makes all things beautiful in this time, he will reach out to you in the name of Jesus. Amen. And I'm believing God today that the prayer fire, the prayer mantle, the mantle of intercession, the mantle to love the Lord will come upon you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Wonders Without Number is a prayer platform and an altar of wonders where people are groomed and drilled and tutored and raised in the act of praying and falling in love with the word of God. Jeremiah 23, 29. It's not my word like a fire and like a hammer that breaketh the rock in pieces. The possibility of God's word, the practical potency of God's word is being experienced right on this platform. The Bible says, Matthew 24, 35, heaven and earth shall pass away, but my words shall not pass away. The, the potency, the practical possibility and potency of God's word shall be affected in your life today in the name of Jesus. Amen. The Bible says in Acts 19, 20, so grew the word of God and prevailed. So grew the word of God 
and prevail. So the word of God will prevail in your life. It will prevail in the circumstances where you are find you find yourself now. It will prevail in every ramification, every facet of your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. I want you to know that there is power in the word of God. The Bible says in Hebrews 1 verse 3, he upholds all things by the word of his power. There is power in the word of God. He upholds all things by the word of his power. And I believe God with you today by the power of the Holy Spirit that there shall be a manifestation and a practical demonstration of the power of the Holy Spirit in your life. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Jesus, the son of David, the son of God, I decree you will prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your children will prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your loved ones will prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your spouse will prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your career will prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your profession will prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your work with God will prosper. Amen. I decree today by the power of the Holy Spirit that nothing can stop you nothing can stop you nothing can stop your children nothing can stop your family nothing can stop your career nothing can stop your profession in the name of Jesus Christ Amen. I'm telling you we're going to pray today I'm so excited that the testimonies you are getting so many but amongst all the miracles and the manifestation, whenever I hear somebody say, I now pray like never before. I now love God. I now love the word. It just rings a bell inside of me that we are actually in tandem and in line and in sync with that which the Lord instructed us to do. To make people love God. That's all. That's all. To make people love God. Just to make people love God. To make people ignore what they are going through. To make people follow God, not on a transactional level. Just love him. Love him. Love him. The Bible says in Luke chapter 13, verse 12. When Jesus saw her, he called her to him. And said to her, Woman, thou art loosed from thy infirmity. I am loosed from infirmity. I am loosed from infirmity. This woman was bowed together. So infirmity is that thing that keeps you on the floor. Infirmity is that thing that puts your head down. Infirmity is that thing that stops you from lifting up your heads to stand amongst the community of men. Infirmity is a restriction, a limitation. The word sickness, disease. Disease is anything that takes away your ease. Whatever makes life uneasy is disease. She was bowed together. The Bible says, and Jesus said, Ought not this woman be loosed? I am loosed from infirmity. When you say I'm loosed from infirmity, you are saying you are loosed from every limitation, every restriction. Whatever has stopped and quarantined you to a spot, I am loosed from infirmity. 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 I am loosed. You are going to cry out to the Lord. You are going to scream out loud and clear. Loud and very clear. I am loose from infirmity. 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 You will lift your voice and scream it loud and clear. And let the Lord hear your voice loud and clear. Loud and clear. I am loose. Write it on your page. Write it on your platform. Write it everywhere. I am loose from infirmity. I am loose from infirmity. Number one. I am loose from infirmity. Shout it louder. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of the Holy Ghost. I am loose from infirmity. By the force of grace. I am loose from infirmity. By the Spirit of God. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Christ. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Christ. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Christ. I am 
I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Christ, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Christ, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Christ, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus, I am loose from infirmity. Da 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 da
Spirit, that you are loose from infirmity in the name of Jesus. Amen. I say you are loose from infirmity in the name of Jesus. Amen. You are loose from infirmity in the name of Jesus. Amen. You are loose from infirmity in the name of Jesus. Amen. Now this is strange. I see somebody in the realms of the spirit. There is a nest, N-E-S-T, that's been built on your head. This attack you are seeing now is demonic birds coming to perch on your head. And it happens towards the end of the month and it is terrible. It's like your head is almost pulling off. That's the physical manifestation. 
But the spiritual manifestations I saw when we were praying, a nest on your head, that birds spiritually come to perch on that nest and it affects your head literally sometimes they will have to hold your head sometimes they have to tie it sometimes they have to keep pouring water something you've been to the hospital every month end is a crisis today i set the nest on fire and i command it disappear in the name of jesus Amen. someone every three months your legs just get swollen swollen for a whole month you stay at home so a whole month you'll be at home you manage yourself for three months another one full month because of the attacks the periodical attacks on your legs whatever that represents in the realms of the spirit i nullify it in the name of jesus christ amen, amen. Somebody say, I am loose from infirmity. 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 Look at what the Bible says here. In verse 13. And he laid his hands on her. And immediately she was made straight and glorified God. Lord, lay your hands on me. Lord Jesus, 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 you cried louder than that. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. Shout it louder than that. My father, my father. Whatever you are watching for, touch the like button and begin to share the link. Please touch the like button now. Everyone watching, go ahead immediately. Touch the like button. Don't waste time. Don't waste time. Do it at this moment. Do it at this moment. Do it at this moment. Touch the like button. Everybody begin to touch it. Touch the like button. Touch the like button and begin to share the link. Touch the like button and begin to share the link. Touch the like button. Do that now. And begin to share the link. Do that. Do that. Do that. Do that. Touch the like button and share the link. Everyone, touch the like button. Everyone, and share the link. Share the link. Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lay your hands on me. Lay your hands on me. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lay your hands on me. Lay your hands on me. Open your mouth and fire prayer Yeah, 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 yeah
Father, we thank you. We want to say how much we love you. We want to say how much we love you. Thank you, Lord, for the answers to our prayers. Thank you, Lord, for showing yourself strong on our behalf. We say thank you. We say thank you. We say thank you. We say thank you, Lord. We say thank you. You have answered our prayers. You have shown us great mercy. We say thank you, Lord. 
We say thank you. You have met all our needs. You have granted our desires, Lord. We say thank you. We say thank you. Father, we are loose from infirmity in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I decree as you hear the sound of my voice, connect your faith to my faith. I connect. By the power of the Holy Spirit, may the Almighty God lay his hands on you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. May the hand of God be laid on your life, on your children, on your interests, your investment, all that God has called you to do, all that God has created you to be. May God lay his hands on you to fulfill them. May God lay his hands on you in the very places and spots and areas of your life where you have given up. May God turn your life around and give you a testimony. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. I speak the grace of God upon you. I hear Cindy. Oji. The Lord says I should tell you. The past couple of years in your life, there have been so much losses. But this is what the Almighty God says to tell you. That we feel the vacuum in your life. It will complete you and restore the years that have been lost. And it will give you a testimony that will make you the voice in your family line. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I see a man who has got a problem with one side. You don't, you, when you sleep, you, you maintain one side. You can't use the other side because your ribs, as it were, are on fire if you try to do it. So they are giving you drugs to be able to manage it. But God is healing you now. I hear a certain Joshua McDonald. This is what the Lord said to tell you. He said, The hand of God is upon you. The mandate of God is upon you. But he said, I should tell you that he wants to amplify your voice. There are altars and foundational struggles down your father's family. It has caught up with a lot of people. It has swallowed them up before their time. He said, But for you, I should tell you that those evil altars you will surmount them. I see God putting on you royalty, royalty, like uh, pearls, diamond, almond, gold, silver. So the Lord says that royalty is your portion. You will appear before great people in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I see somebody by the name of Bibiana. They took your child from you, your child. I don't know what happened, but the Lord is bringing the child back. Give you access back to your child. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. I speak a blessing upon you all. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. You are sick in body. Put your left hand on that spot. Si in malade, mettez votre main gauche. I command sickness to Je go. La la Stretch your hand towards me. I command disease to go. Et les autres maladies de partie, I rebuke cancer. Je de cancer. I rebuke tumor. Les tumeurs. I rebuke fibroids. Les I rebuke HIV. Les VIH. I rebuke every virus. Je tout virus. Every infection. Les infections. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Dans le nom de Jésus. I decree be totally healed. Vous êtes guéri totalement. Be made whole. Soyez guéri complètement. Be made whole. Soyez guéri complètement. From your head to your toes. De la tête jusqu'au pied. Somebody who got a problem with your spinal cord, God is healing you. Le Seigneur vous guérit des problèmes de colonne a terrible knee injury. Il y a un footballeur qui a le problème de genou. God has healed you. Le Seigneur vient de vous guérir. There is somebody you are a black belt and you are into um, martial arts. Il y a quelqu'un qui est dans les arts martiaux. You got this, your bone got dislocated in one of your training sessions. Votre os est dislocé. Le Seigneur vous guérit. Everyone be healed. Toute personne soyez guéri. In Jesus name. Dans Amen. le nom de Jésus. Amen. The Lord bless you as you pray with us. May your grand our desires be granted. We're not going to take our offerings. Though. My time has come. Amen. Amen. We love the Lord. We thank him for keeping us alive and well. We thank the Lord for keeping us alive. We thank him for his grace and his mercies that are bound and are new every morning. We thank him for the gift of life. We thank him for the breath. We thank him for keeping us alive. We thank him for keeping our family. Lord, we thank you. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.
Welcome to Wonders Without Number. My time has come. Amen. Somebody say it seven times. My time has come. Number one. My time has come. Say it again. 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 My time has come. The Bible says in Psalm 102, verse 13, Thou shalt arise and have mercy upon Zion for the time to favor her. Yea, the set time is come. And I believe God that your set time for the miracle, your set time for the breakthrough has come, your set time for the testimony, your set time for the move of God has come. I believe God with you. Without any shadow of doubt, I believe God that whatever has caused you unrest today shall be laid to rest. Amen. I believe your amen. Whatever has caused you unrest today shall be laid to rest. Amen. amen. Whatever has stolen your rest and peace today shall rest in pieces. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. The blessings of God will abound in your life. The tangible, visible, seeable, touchable, feelable, noticeable blessings of God will abound in your life greatly that you begin to enjoy the promises of the Father, the promise of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. That great things will begin to happen in your life. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Wonders Without Number is an altar of wonders and a prayer platform where people are groomed and tutored and raised in the act of praying and getting addicted to scripture. If you get it right with scripture, you get it right in your work with God. Nothing pilots your work with God effectively like your addiction to scriptures. Nothing pilots your work with God effectively like scriptural addiction, not just addiction, scriptural applications. When you see the word of God and you study it, you apply it and you begin to get uncommon and outstanding results. When these results begin to manifest in your life, it becomes profiting before all. In the name of Jesus, receive that grace right now. Amen. If you are watching by television, I want to call somebody and get the person seated and tell the person that one that's without numbers on the air. And tell the person, if there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If you are watching online, touch the like button and begin to share the link and do what you share and share through. That thou mayest prosper. That thou mayest prosper. That thou mayest prosper. Psalm 35, 24 tells us that God takes pleasure in the prosperity of his servant. He takes pleasure. So if, if, if the prosperity of his servant gives him pleasure, it means their poverty, their lack gives him displeasure. You see, gives him displeasure. So God takes pleasure. What is prosperity? Prosperity is all around blessings. The blessings of God upon your life. And in the kingdom, the prosperity that God wants to give us is a prosperity that is connected to the prosperity of the soul. Your prosperity in this life is on the platform of your soulish prosperity. Third John verse 2 says, I wish above all things that thou mayest prosper and be in health even as thy soul prospereth. Be in health. Many of you will notice as you are entering next year, you shall be in health in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. That constant off and on attack on your body ends today. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Say, I shall be in health. 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 In the name of Jesus. Amen. So shall it be. So shall it be. We have a prayer today from Luke 15. We are going to pray and call upon the Lord. And we believe he's going to answer us by fire. And we answer us. We bless your name. Thank you, my father. In Jesus' name we worship. Amen. Luke chapter 15, verse 13. And not many days after, the younger son gathered all together and took his journey into a far country and there wasted his substance in riot with riotous living wasted his substance there's so much god has deposited inside of you we pray this prayer may i not waste heaven's investment 
in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. God has given you talent and gifts and ability, money and time and education, intellect. But today the enemy has invaded into our lives like the prodigal son. Making us feel there is something outside God. There is nothing outside God. There is no life outside God. There is no life outside God. You will pray. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment. Write this down. This is a very important, a most important prayer. May I not waste heaven's investment. Touch the like button even as you share the link. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not write it on your platform or your page. Write it now so that every day it can stand there as a prophetic declaration. It has become a written prophecy that you will not waste heaven's investment in your life. The investment of heaven in your life will not be wasted. Whether it is gift, talents, and abilities, whether it is a job, a profession, a career, a platform, you will not waste it. God will not feel grieved for elevating you. You will cry that cry to God. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Number one. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Shout it again. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Shout again. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Shout again. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Shout again. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Shout again. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. Sorry, 
I decree upon your life as you hear the sound of my voice in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ you will not waste heaven's investment on your life Amen. Amen. in the name of Jesus you will not waste heaven's investment on your life Amen. Amen. in the name of Jesus you will not waste heaven's investment on your life Amen. Amen. investment of heaven on your life wisdom talent gifts ability money time uh, connection contact I decree will not be wasted in the name of Jesus Amen. Amen. I decree that this investment will make heaven proud we make God proud of you Holy Spirit do it Holy Spirit do it in our lives that investment of God in our life will not be a waste and heaven will be proud of us when you look from heaven at these investments your heart will be pleased be it time be it intellect, ideas, vision, gifting, talents, abilities, insight, depth. It's all investment that you gave us for the profiting of the kingdom. Help us. Help us. To profit with her. And that the name of the Lord be glorified. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. In Luke, still in chapter 15, verse 15, he went and joined himself to a citizen of that country. That country. And they sent him into the feeds to feed swine. Lord, restrain me 
from ungodly connections. Lord, restrain me. Sometimes you must understand that God wants you to move with the right people. People that will add value. Proverbs 13 verse 20 says, He that walketh with the wise shall be wise, but a companion of fools shall be destroyed. God wants you to be with the right people. Restrain me, Lord, from ungodly connections. Lord, restrain me. Any connection that is ungodly, restrain me. May the zeal to attach myself to such people die. May the zeal to attach myself to such contacts die. Restrain me from ungodly connections. You will cry to God. You will cry to the Lamb of God. You will cry to the ancient of days. You will cry to the great I am. You will cry to the El Shaddai. The Lion of Judah's tribe. You will cry. You will lift your voice and cry. Restrain me from ungodly connections. You will lift your voice and you will cry. Restrain me from ungodly connections. 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 Restrain me. Write that down. Restrain me from. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. Shout it louder. My father, my father. Shout it louder. My father, my father. Shout it louder. My father, my father. Shout it again. My father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. Restrain me. Restrain me. From ungodly connection. From ungodly connection. Restrain me. Restrain me. From ungodly connection. From ungodly connection. Restrain me. Restrain me. From ungodly connection. From ungodly connection. Restrain me. Restrain me. From ungodly connection. From ungodly connection. Ratuba Masa.
In the name of Jesus. Amen. I say in the name of Jesus. Amen. Connect your faith to my faith. I, I connect. I decree today the grace to maintain, retain the investment of heaven in your life rest upon you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I decree by the power of the Holy Spirit every ungodly connection, ungodly contact you find yourself in already that is sapping your spiritual strength. That is snuffing out the supernatural life that God has given to you. That is, that is making your light to dwindle. That is affecting the brightness of your star. That is making you recede to hell. Recede backwards. That is killing your love for God. Making you lukewarm. The Lord break it from that connection. Amen. The Lord break it from that connection. Amen. The Lord break it from that connection. Amen. May the Lord give you connections that will inspire you. We make you love God. Love him. And love him. And love him. I see somebody. You were born on the 4th of July. Your life has been in a mess as it were. And you are, you are, you are willing and crying to God. You've taken out some time to pray. That God, please put my life together. God says, I should tell you. That in the next couple of days, something heavy is coming. Something big. Something great. And this will become a tether out in your entire life. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Ashu. Morin. Morin Ashu. I see two people 
pulling you, one on the left, one on the right. There's like a contest. I don't know what is happening. In the midst of two people, these two people are contending, as vowed that your life is going to be a battleground. Today, let the ground open and swallow them. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I don't know who you are. There, are. there are 73 people. The Lord says I should tell you that His light will shine in your life. His light will shine in your life. Someone is being delivered from a serpent. That serpent dies now. May the Lord arise and give you a testimony. A woman has children. And all the children, about five of them, are plagued with one attack to the other. But God has healed the five of them now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. We call it done. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. If you are sick in body, si vous êtes malade, place your left hand on that mettez la main gauche là, where you are hurting là vous avez des problèmes, and stretch your hand to me. Main vers moi. I command sickness to go. Je la maladie de partir. I command disease to go. Les affections de partir. I command affliction to go. Les affections de partir. From the crown of your hair de la tête to the sole of your feet. Jusqu'à vos pieds. Be made whole. Soyez guéris. Made whole. Soyez guéris. Made whole. Soyez guéris. In the name of Jesus Christ. Dans le Amen. nom de Jésus. It is well with you. Tout va bien avec vous. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. The Lord bless you. We we'll take our offerings. Your time has come. Amen. Our time has come. Amen. We are grateful to God for the testimonies he's bringing our way and the miracles that are happening in the lives of thousands and thousands and millions of people around the world. And we are praying that these testimonies will abound and will continue to multiply in the name of Jesus. Amen. I believe God with you today is a new week. We are entering our believing God for great grace that this week promises under God to be most profound, most powerful, most outstanding. I believe God with you today that everything that is a desire in your heart, the Holy Spirit will grant them, the Lord Jesus will meet them, and the power of God will affect them and it will come to pass speedily in the name of Jesus. Amen. Wonders Without Number is a prayer platform and an altar of wonders where people are groomed, drilled, tutored, and raised in the art of praying and falling in love with the words of God. There is power in the word of God. There is power in the word of God. Proverbs 13, 13, he that despises the word shall be destroyed. There is power in the word of God. He that despises the word shall be destroyed. That's what the word of the Lord says. I believe in the power of God's word. Hebrews 4.12 The word of God is quick and powerful, sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing to the dividing asunder of the soul and spirit, of the joints and marrows, and is a descender of the thoughts and the intents of the heart. There is power in the word of God. Jeremiah 15, 16, that word were found, I did eat them, and they became a rejoicing unto my soul. I'm called by the name O Lord of hosts. I believe God today that by the power of the word of God that will be effected in your life. Anything that you desire of the Lord, any desire, any heart cry, I decree in the name of Jesus, it shall be met. Amen. 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 Heart cry concerning your children. And make this prophetic declaration. Heart cry concerning your children. Heart cry concerning your loved ones. Heart cry concerning your home. Heart cry concerning your investments, your career, your job. In the name of Jesus, it shall be met. Amen. All right. If you are watching by television, I want to get seated and tell somebody if there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If you are watching online, touch the like button and begin to share the link. Share the link until you share and share and share through hey. father we thank you go ahead and worship the lord today worship the lamb of god and we worship you lord we give you all the glory all the praise all the honor all adoration we worship you 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 
in jesus name i decree upon your life in the name of jesus anything missing in your life whatever needs to be in your life to give your life color to give your life relevance to give your life a meaning to give your life a footing to give your life balance to give your life a, a, a flavor to give your life glamour whatever you need in your life that will beautify your life and is currently and presently not there I decree in the name of Jesus, it is released now. Amen. It is released now. Amen. May your life become colorful. Your life become bright. Your life receive illumination. And I decree in the name of Jesus, nothing lacking, nothing broken. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Nothing lacking, nothing broken in the name of Jesus. Amen. Nothing lacking, nothing broken in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I don't know why the Lord is telling me this. He said, I should say to a family, the premature death that killed your father, that killed your uncles that has been a pattern in the family that people die premature in the name of jesus because you are praying with me today by the force of grace anyone who is standing as a strong man to maintain that altar to service that altar may that altar take that person now Amen. the yoke of premature untimely death is broken in the name of jesus Amen. Ah, yeah 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 it's broken in the name of jesus Amen. i see a young lady by the name of stella you are watching right now there's a, a, a marital delay in your in your family the only thing that people do is that they give birth to children but they cannot have a legal marriage and you've been trying to be different but you had several disappointments and you love to settle right now god says i should tell you let a miracle hit you let the one that god has ordained for you manifest and show forth in the name of jesus christ Amen. I call it forth. 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 In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. Touch the like button if you're not following us on C on uh, uh, Michel Arrow. Follow us if you're not following us on Instagram. Please follow us on Osgram. Follow us on Osgram. Follow us on Osgram. Follow us on Mixel Arrow and follow us on Osgram. If you are not following us on Osgram, it's very, very important. Jeremiah chapter 30, verse 17. I will restore health unto thee. Say amen. Amen. I will heal thee of thy wounds. Amen. Say the Lord, because they called thee an outcast, saying, This is Zion, whom no man seeketh after. I want to pick that scripture that phrase i will heal thee of thy wounds what is that thing that you're nursing that pain that injury something happened you find it hard to be healed you find it hard to be consoled god say i should tell you it will heal you of your wounds. in the name of jesus it will heal you of your wounds. what happened is it marriage is it ministry is it finances is it your business is it your home i will heal you of thy wounds God says today, it will heal you of your wounds. In the name of Jesus, it will heal you of your wounds. You pray, Lord, heal me of my wounds. Lord, heal me. Write it down on your platform, on your page. Write it, Lord, heal me of my wounds. 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 He said, I will heal thee of thy wounds. Lord, heal me of my 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 wounds. Write that down on your page. Write it on your platform. Write it everywhere. Lord, heal me of my wounds. 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 Write it down your platform and hashtag wonders with a number. Lord, heal me. Write it everywhere. Everywhere. Go on IG. Write it. Facebook. Write it. YouTube. Write it. Go on Twitter. Write it. Write it everywhere everywhere lord heal me of my wounds lord heal me of my wounds 
Lord, heal me of my wounds. Number one. Lord, heal me of my wounds. Shout again. 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 Lord, heal me of my wounds. Ragada, ragada,
pray. Yeah. There's a young, a young chap. You are a Muslim. Your name is Ali. And you have been having encounters with God. And you have been wondering, what are these dreams? You are having encounters, strong encounters with God. Because God wants to use you mightily. But there is a connection to the water world. The man-made power that has clung on to you today. It breaks in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. May you encounter the Lord Jesus and know him for yourself. May you receive him as your Lord and your master. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. The Lord says he's healing somebody by the name of Helen. With pains on the side. God is healing you now. God is healing you now. God is healing you now. And I decree everyone who is not seen an injury, a wound, that when you think about what happened, it's fresh in your mind. And you are hurting. I decree by the power of the Holy Spirit. The Lord says I should tell you something that would gladden your heart is about to happen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. It will give you something that will gladden your heart. Hey, you have been wounded. Wounded by friends, colleagues, relatives, family members. The Lord is healing your heart right now. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. God is healing your heart. I don't know the stories you have carried, the stories you have carried on, the way you have been treated by people. God is healing your heart. In the name of Jesus. Amen. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. Verse 19. Out of them shall proceed thanksgiving. The voice of them that make merry, I will multiply them, they shall not be few. I will glorify them, they shall, they shall not be small. You see, from them shall proceed thanksgiving. Multiply them, not few. Glorify them, not small. God wants to change your story in both size and everything you do. Give me a total turnaround. Oh Lord, arise. Give me a total turnaround. You will pray that prayer for yourself, for your family. Oh Lord, arise. Give me a total turnaround. Oh Lord, arise. Give me a total turn around. Oh Lord, arise. Give me a total turn around. Oh Lord, arise. Give me a total turn around. Oh Lord, arise. Give me a total turn around. Oh Lord, arise. Give me a total turn around. Oh Lord, arise. Give me a total turn around. Oh Lord, arise. Give me a total turn around. Oh Lord, say, My Father, my Father. My Father, my Father. Shout it louder. My Father, my Father. Shout it two more times. My Father, my Father. Shout it one more time. My Father, my Father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. Oh Lord, arise. 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 Give me a total turn around. Give me a total turn around. Oh Lord, arise. 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 Give me a total turn around. 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 Open your mouth and fire. Yeah, I'm 
Connect your faith to my faith. I connect. Wherever you hear the sound of my voice, I pray for you. And I decree by the power of the Holy Ghost, may God heal your wounds now. Amen. May God heal your wounds now. Amen. Somebody has a brother called George. He's in jail. The Lord is setting him free now. He's being released. He's being set free by the power of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Someone has an organization or this is a business. I guess something like Tarius. That's why you name the name. You name the business after Tarius. The Lord said, I should tell you that whatever attack was fired to that business, the Lord is putting an end to it. That business begins to flourish again in the name of Jesus. Amen. Kola Mana Saradash. God says I should pray for parent. Parent. P-E-R-E-Y. That's what I see. The Lord says I should tell you that something good is coming soon. And you will not be alone. You will not be able to handle it alone. Because of the blessings that God is bringing in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I hear a name like Susan Egbune. Susan Egbune. The Lord says, I should tell you to get ready because celebration is coming to your house. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. I decree that the Lord give you a total turnaround. A total turnaround in your marriage. A total turnaround in your home, in your business, in your family. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. If you are sick in body, put your left hand on that spot. Si vous êtes malade, mettez votre main gauche. I come against sickness Je viens contre les maladies that has plagued you. Et qui vous a joué. I command you to come out now. Je commande de sortir. Whatever is not of God Tout ce qui pas de Dieu, in your body, dans votre corps, come out now. Anything missing in your body Tout ce qui manque dans votre that corps, you need in your body, dont vous avez besoin, that you need in your kidney, dont vous avez besoin de, that you need in your mind, dans, dans votre pensée, that you need in your skin, dans votre peau, receive it now in the name of Jesus. May the healing power of God touch you from your head to your toes. Touch. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you and honor you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let's take our offerings right now. Oh, God bless you. Welcome to one that's without number. My time has come. Amen. My time has come. Amen. I am super grateful, super excited to God for what he's doing in your life. All the testimonies that you are sending to us and the mind-blowing transformation in your work with God. That's our ultimate. That is why we are here. People are testifying that their work with God is now colorful, it's now bright, there's proximity. They now command that ambience of God. And like I say on this platform, you are God's headquarters. And I believe God with you today, if you are just joining us for the first time, or this is your first week or first month with us, or maybe just for one or two months, and you're joining us, I want you to know that the mantle to pray, the grace to pray, will come upon you. We are commissioned to pray. Prayer is not an advice, it's a command. Men ought always to pray and not to faint. Luke 18, verse 1. Men ought always, men, 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 not people, not everyone. Men, men, men ought always. So those that pray always are men. Those that pray always are men. They are grown, they are matured. Men ought always. So men is men that pray. Men don't complain. Men don't murmur. When they have a burden in their heart, they take it to prayers. When they have a desire, they take it to prayers. When they have a need, they take it to prayers. When they have a confusion in their mind, they take it to prayers. That is how you know you are growing and growing in the Lord. Welcome. My time has come. Amen. 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 Whenever we say my time has come, we're connecting to Psalm 102, verse 13. Thou shalt arise and have mercy upon Zion for the time to favor her. Yea, the set time is come. The time for mercy. The time. Whenever you say my time has come, you are attracting two, two components mercy and favor. Mercy. And favor. Mercy shows, favor flows. Whenever you say, My time has come, mercy shows, favor flows. That thou 
mayest prosper. That thou mayest prosper. That thou mayest prosper. In the name of Jesus, I breathe this prophecy into your life. I breathe this prophecy into the life of your children. I breathe this prophecy into your family. I breathe this prophecy into your career. I breathe this prophecy into your organization. You will prosper. Amen. I can hear you. You will prosper. Amen. 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 Anything that your hand finds. Tomorrow, by the help of God, I want you to hold the works of your hand. What is that thing that you do? Hold it tomorrow. Get something to represent what you do tomorrow. Tomorrow. Get something to represent what you do. You are going to keep it as we are praying. Because I'm going to pray on it that the Lord, through the works of your hand, will prosper you. I said the Lord will prosper you. Amen. 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 You will hold it tomorrow. Whatever you do, whatever the works of your hands are, you will hold it and God will bless the work of your hands. The Lord will bless the work of your hands. The Lord will bless the works of your hands. The Lord will bless the works of your hands. The Lord will bless the works of your hands. The Lord will bless the works of your hands. In the name of Jesus. Wonders Without Number is a prayer platform and an altar of wonders where people are groomed and tutored and drilled and schooled in the act of praying and falling in love with the word of God. The word of God is powerful. We fall in love with the word of God on this platform. The word of God becomes meaning, becomes life to us, becomes effective to us, becomes powerful to us as we open up our heart to it. And I believe God with you. As you open up your, your mind, your hearts, the illumination and the light of God's incomprehensible word, God's indefatigable, infallible word, indisputable, incontestable, impregnable word, will show forth its light and bring forth results, undeniable results in your life, in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If you are watching right now on television, tell somebody if there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If you are watching online, touch the like button, begin to share the link, share and share and share and share until you are able to share through. Keep sharing, keep sharing, don't stop sharing until you share through. But touch the like button now, touch the like button and share the link as we begin to pray. As we begin to call upon the Lord, as we 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 come, there's someone, you're a lady, you had to cut your hair because of what is happening. The kind of pain and aches you feel, so you had to cut the hair. You have to cut it literally. Cut your hair. Whatever is walking and moving around the hair, causing you so much discomfort and pain, like a serpent. Today, it dies in the name of Jesus. Amen. May the hand of the heaven be extended to you. And the mercy of God come upon you right now. And God heal you. That you be made whole and healed and free and set free transform be healed right now the god of heaven heal you in jesus name amen somebody say my time has come my time has come in songs of solomon chapter 2 and verse 15 is it take ox the forces the little foxes that spoil the vines for our vines have tender grapes, little foxes. Lord, deliver me from little foxes. There are things in your life that are contending your prayers. Sometimes your character is louder than your voice. Your attitude might be louder than your prayers. Little foxes. What is that thing in your life that God is not happy about? Lord, take it away. What is that thing in your life that God is not happy? Take it away! Right now. In Galatians chapter 5 and verse 9, it says a little leaven. 
left not the old law. You see, apostle, it's a very little thing. How little is little? How little is little? A little level, a little stain levels. Lord, deliver me from little foxes. Lord, deliver me from little foxes. Deliver me from the little foxes that spoil the vine. Deliver me from the little foxes. Write that down on your page. Write on your platform. Write everywhere. Deliver me from little foxes. Deliver me from the little foxes. Deliver me from the little foxes. Deliver me from the little foxes, Lord. Deliver me from the little foxes. 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 Write it on your platform everywhere. Write it. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Deliver me. That thing in my life that is not of God, that is contending answers. I have prayed and prayed. I'm not seeing the answers I expect. And I desire because of these foxes in my life. Father, deliver me from them. These foxes you are not happy about. I may know them, I may not know them. Deliver me, Lord. 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 Oh, Rabaka Silemondras. Deliver me from the little foxes. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. We're going to shout it loud again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Number one. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shut up, 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 shut up
I decree upon your life today by the power of the Holy Spirit every little fox whatever is in your life domiciled that thing that grieves the spirit that thing that pricks the Lord in your life in your speech in your words in your attitude in your character 
in your statements, in your thoughts, that makes God unhappy with you, that turns away the eyes of God from you, that makes the angels helpless and powerless. May God take it away in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. May God take it away in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. May the fullness of God's plan, the fullness of God's purity, the fullness of God's holiness, righteousness, right standing. May your garment become white and your head lack no ointment. May you be spotless from the world, preserved, blameless, without blemish, wrinkle, or any such thing. The Lord purify you and sanctify you through his truth for his word is truth may he keep you unspotted from the world in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ Amen. Amen. receive that grace now someone is supposed to have a heart surgery the Lord says I should tell you right now as we are talking the Lord is handling it and open that surgery the Lord is saying is taking care of your heart brand new heart is giving you a brand new heart now brand new heart a miracle is taking place the Lord is doing it he's doing it in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ Amen Kobaranasata Beruta Kalasi Gebelidas someone who has not been able to pass out urine I don't know what attack that is it's like an obstruction you have to use a pipe to get out urine from you but right now I decree the passageway is open it's open by the hand of the Almighty be healed in the name of Jesus Christ Amen. Amen. touch the like button and begin to share the link right now share the link share the link there is power right now flowing and, and cancelling medical reports, deadly medical reports. Those cases, the doctors have written you off. God is handling it now. The doctors have given you up to die. I command the yoke of infirmity. That terminal disease, cancer, growth, that virus, come out in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. That you be totally whole made whole healed in the name of Jesus Amen. Amen. right now be healed be healed in Jesus name Amen. Amen. Songs of Solomon chapter 2 and verse 4 hmm. he brought me into the banqueting house his banner over me, over me was love Lord, by your love, usher me to my place of celebration. He brought me into the banqueting house. Hey, someone is entering the banqueting house. Someone is entering celebration. Someone is entering celebration. Someone is entering celebration. This December is without disaster. This December shall be the best for you. Someone is entering celebration. God is ushering you to your place of celebration. He's ushering you to the banqueting house. God is ushering you to the banqueting house. He's ushering you to the banqueting house. He's ushering you to the banqueting house. He's usher you to the banqueting house hey usher me to my place lord by your love lord by your love lord by your love usher me to my place of celebration lord by your love usher me to my place of celebration he brought me into the banqueting house for his banner over me was love Lord, by your love, usher me into my place of celebration. Say, my father, my father. My, my father, father, my father. Shout it louder. My, my father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin to, to pray. pray. Lord, by your love. 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 Usher me to my place of celebration. 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 
celebration. Lord by your Lord. 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 Usher me to my place of celebration. 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 Lord by your Lord. 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 Usher me to my place of celebration. 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 Father, in the name of Jesus, 
Father, in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Father, in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Father, in the name of Jesus. Yeah. We come to you today. And we decree that by your love, usher us into the place of celebration. Take us to the place of rest. Take us to the place of jubilation. The place of a new beginning turn around. Take us to that place. We decree every little fox in our life. Whatever is inside us spiritually, whatever is around us physically, that you are not happy, you constantly frown out, Father, take it away. Take it away. Take it away. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. There's a sports person who just sprained the ankle. The Lord is healing you right now. There's someone, your last name is Taylor. You are Liberian. You've been having this problem running through the life of your family members. The same evil pattern of not ending well. Today, that yoke is broken from your life and from everyone coming after you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. I hear a name like Andrew Iramoselli. Andrew Iramoselli. The Lord is showing me something now. He said in your family, anytime they get close to something good, something bad happens. And it takes them back to square one. Sometimes they will so go back, they will empty all that they have before they will try to want to come forward again. Something bad will happen. They will go back, empty all they have to want to come in the name of Jesus. That pattern is broken. Amen. It's broken. Amen. Paramana crash down. There's a lady, your name is Pastor Favor. This priest has to tell you that for everything you have, that for everything you have lost, in the year 2024, it's going to bring double. It's going to make your life beautiful. It's going to give you peace. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I see a woman, you are watching me from South Africa. You are worried concerning your son. So worried about your son. The Lord says, I should tell you not to worry. Because help is coming. The help that you will you, you break down, so surprised, in tears of joy, a supernatural help that will bring a shift that will change the trajectory of his life is happening right now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. There's a youth couple watching me, NYSC member. You are sick, very sick. The healing power of God is even affecting your skin. The healing power of God is touching you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. If you are sick in body, put your left hand on that spot si malade, votre and stretch your right hand. I command sickness to go. Je commande la maladie de partir. Someone is a disease on the neck. Quelqu'un a une maladie au cou. A swollen neck like goiter. Et votre cou est gonflé. Dissolve. Que cela se dissout. Let the neck come to normal size. Que cela revienne à la normale. Someone has a growth. Quelqu'un a une tumeur. By the side of the ankle. Au niveau. The growth has disappeared. Cela disparaît. There's someone you have an addiction, you inject yourself. Vous avez une addiction, vous it's a kind of thing you take. If you don't take it, you can't calm down. Si vous ne prenez pas, vous n'êtes pas à l'aise. You're addicted to it. Some kind addicted. of pill. You have to inject yourself. Et vous avez besoin d'injecter. I command. Je commande. That addiction. Que cette addiction. Break in the name of Jesus. Amen. May you be totally free. Que vous soyez totalement libre. And healed. Et guéri. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Your time has come. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Your prayers are answered. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Let's take our offering right now. Yes, you welcome to one that without number. My time has come. Amen. Your time has come. Amen. Our time has come. Amen. In the name of Jesus, my time has come. Amen. My time has come. Amen. Somebody said, This is the season. This is the season. That the Lord has made. That the Lord has made. I will rejoice. I will rejoice. I'll be glad in it. I'll be glad in it. This is the moment. This is the moment. That Jesus has made. That Jesus has made. I will rejoice. I will rejoice. And be glad in it. I'll be glad in it. This is the hour. This is the hour that Jesus has made. That Jesus has made. I will rejoice. I will rejoice. I'm be glad in it. I'm glad in it. Somebody say, my time has come. 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 Wonders without number is a prayer platform and an altar of wonders where people are groomed and drilled and tutored in the art of praying and falling in love with the word of God, getting addicted to the word of God. There is 
in the words of God. Hebrews 1 verse 3 says, He upholds all things by the word of his power. The Bible says in Matthew 24, 35, Heaven and earth shall pass away, but my words shall not pass away. When Daniel made up his mind to contend with the prince of Persia, the prince of that atmosphere of Persia, the Bible says the angel came and the angel said to him in Daniel chapter 10 verse 12, Oh Daniel, from the first day that thou didst send thy heart to chasten thyself before the Lord, thy words were heard and I have come for thy words. When we come into the presence of the Lord, God gives us a warning and gives us and information in Hosea chapter 14 verse 2 he said take with you words so when we come to God's presence we take words and this platform and this family is where we pray scriptural prayers we pick scriptures and begin to pray them John 1 14 and the word was made flesh and dwelt among men the word of God can become tangible and holdable and touchable if prayer can be attached to it and I'm telling you in the name of Jesus the mantle of grace will fall upon you today amen, amen. We hear countless people around the world coming to testify that since they became part of this family, their love for God has increased. Their passion for God has increased. They are now in love with God. They are passionate about God. They love the things of God. They love everything about God. And I'm telling you the truth, that in the name of Jesus, you are going to become a partaker and you are going to become a functionary in that department of God lovers in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. That thou, the plan and purpose of God is for you to prosper. He says in third John, verse 2, I wish above all things that thou mayest prosper and be in health even as thy soul prosper in the name of Jesus. I prophesy prosperity comes your way. Amen. I say prosperity comes your family. Amen. Comes upon your children. Amen. Comes upon your spouse. Amen. Comes upon your profession. Amen. Comes upon your career. Amen. I make this prophetic declaration over all that concerns you. Receive prosperity. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. David said, Lord, send now prosperity. God wants you to prosper. So if you are watching by television, I want you now to call somebody and get yourself tuned. Call somebody if you are watching by television and tell them, if there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If you are watching online, touch the like button and begin to share the link. Share the link until you share through. The word of God is powerful. Share the link and share the link. We are about to pray. And the word of God and the power of God will visit you wherever you are now. The hand of God will touch you. If you are sick in your body, if you have a child that is bound, any form of bondage, the power of God will fall upon you. And you shall be loose. 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 You shall be loose in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I command chains to be broken. I command bondages to be rolled away. Everything that is a mountain in your life, I command mountain. Oh mountain, who art thou, oh great mountain? Who art thou, oh great? What is your name? Who art thou, oh great mountain? What is your name? I command you become a plane. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. The hand of the Lord is heavy upon your life and it will touch you. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Touch the like button, begin to share the link. The hand of God is coming mightily upon you. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. We worship you. Someone has a child and the child is deaf. The child cannot hear. I saw the angel of God pulling out things from the child's ear. The ears are open. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. There is healing power. You have a child, you have a daughter, a grown-up girl, she's about 19, and she's born deaf. She's never heard a word. Now tap and begin to talk to her. The God has opened her ears. Now! In the name of Jesus. Amen. Every autistic child, children with Down syndrome, God is healing them now. God is healing them by the power of the Holy Spirit. Somebody is being prepared, they're prepping you to have an open heart surgery. 
The Lord said, you don't need to go through that. Because what needed to be worked upon, as we take this prayer, just pray with us. The, the operation will begin. The Holy Ghost begins to walk and correct it and make you whole. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Someone, you, you, are, you are in a certain nation. You, you, are, you don't reside there. You left your country to that nation for medicals. And you've been down. But you are watching me right now through a device. Even the country you are in for medicals, they cannot treat you. They, they can't function well on your body. Because it's like it's beyond them. Right where you are. The power of God is coming upon you. Whatever the Heavenly Father has not planted, whatever God that created your body has not planted, right now, I command you to go. Come out in the name of Jesus. Amen. God has made you whole. Isaiah chapter 3 verse 10, Say ye to the righteous, it shall be well with them. It shall eat the fruit of their doing. It shall be well with them. You will speak. My household, it shall be well with you. 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 God wants us today to pray for our family, your children, your spouse. My household, it shall be well with you. My household, it shall be well with you. You are making declarations. Write that down on your page, on your platform. You are making these declarations. These are prophetic declarations that you are making concerning your household, your children, your husband, your wife. My household, it shall be well with you. My, you must understand. Listen. Listen. He said, thou are snared by the words of your mouth. The words you speak are the platform for your tomorrow's greatness. The words you speak today are the platform for your tomorrow's greatness. The greatness of tomorrow is embedded in the word spoken today. Whatever you are today is a function of the prayers you pray today or the prayers you refuse to pray. When you refuse to pray, you have prayed. By refusing to pray, it's a prayer to fail. Anyone who refuses to pray has indirectly prayed to fail. But anyone who makes up his mind to call upon God as secure tomorrow. Every prayer today is an investment. Sometimes when people pray, they are expecting immediate result. They don't see it. No. Prayer is an investment. You put it in the bank. A day is going to come for your withdrawals. You will cry to God loud and clear. My family, it shall be well with you. My family, it shall be well with you. You, might, you begin to call your family members by name. Call them by name. Your siblings, your parents, your, your children, your, your loved ones. Call them by name. And please write this down on your platform. It's a prophecy. Write it on your platform. Write it now. Write it now on your platform. All your platforms, your WhatsApp story. Write it. My household, it shall be well with you. 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 My household, write it down right now. Write it down on that page. Write it down. My household, it shall be well with you. My household, it shall be well with you. My household, it shall be well with you. Write it on your page now. Number one. My household, it shall be well with you. Shout it louder than that. My household, it shall be well with you. Let the angels of God hear your voice. My household, it shall be well with you. Shout again. My household, it shall be well with you. Shout again. My household, it shall be well with you. Shout again. My household, it shall be well with you. Shout again. My household, it shall be well with you. Shout again. My household, it shall be well with you. Shout again. My household, it shall be well with you. Shout again. My household, it shall be well with you. My household 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 it 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 shall be well with you. Da 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 da
I decree upon your life and speak into your family. I speak into your loved ones. Wherever they are around the nations of the world, I speak to your children's life. In the name of Jesus, it is well with them. Amen. I say it is well with your family. Amen. It is well with your children. Amen. It is well with your loved ones. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. It is well with them. It is well with them. It is well with them. I say it is well with your child. That your son that's giving you concern, it is well with him. That your daughter that's become a reproach to the family is well with her. Your husband that has turned his back on God, it is well with him. I said this word with your household in the name of Jesus. Amen. The counsel of God of God in your family will prosper. That which God has spoken concerning your family will prosper. Oh, Isaiah chapter 54 and verse 15. Even the Lord has given a counsel. Behold, they that we have, he said, they shall surely gather, but not by me. As many as gather together against you, they shall fall for your sake. For I have created the smith that blows the coals into the fire. I bring it for this work. I have created the waste that to destroy. So therefore, no weapon formed against thee shall prosper. But every tongue that riseth in against thee, judgment thou shalt condemn. This is the heritage of the servants of the Lord, and their righteousness of me, said the Lord. I decree 
by the power of the Holy Spirit, your children become source of blessing to you. Amen. Amen. Ah, your children become source of blessing. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Your spouse be a blessing. Amen. Your family be a blessing. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Say to the righteous, it shall be well with them. For they shall eat the fruit of their doings. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. You will pray that prayer loud and clear. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor. In the name of Jesus, I shall eat the fruit of my labor in the name of Jesus I shall eat the fruit of my labor in the name of Jesus I shall eat the fruit of my neighbor say my father my father, my my father, father, my father. shout it loud and clear my my father, my father, my father. shout it loud and clear my my father, my father. Father. in the name of Jesus in in the name the name of Jesus. Jesus. I begin to pray I, begin to to pray. Pray. I shall eat the fruit of my labor in the name of Jesus I begin to pray I shall eat the fruit of my labor I eat the fruit of my labor. 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 I eat
Connect your faith to my faith. I, I connect. I see a mighty harvest coming for your family. I see families that were despised suddenly become lifted. Suddenly becoming the center of attraction, the signature of all eyes. I see your family celebrating in pomp and pageantry. I see a massive celebration coming for your family. You that was not called the people shall be called the people of the living God. I see house number 14. And God says that house celebration is coming. The hand of God is coming upon everyone under the sound of my voice. It is well with your household. It is well with your children. It is well with your siblings. Well with your spouse. I decree they shall eat the fruit of their labor. Begin to eat the fruit of your labor. Your children begin to eat the fruit of their labor. I decree that you will not struggle for others to enjoy. You will not plant for others to harvest. You will not sow for others to reap. You will eat the fruit of your labor. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. To you mother who is holding your breast, I see you. God says, I should tell you concerning your children, you will eat the fruit of your labor. 
to you father you will eat the fruit of your labor to you that went to school and you have no job you will eat the fruit of your labor receive a visitation now in the name of Jesus Amen. Amen. I see somebody in your church you are into the media I just saw you and the Lord is saying that there have been so much troubles in your personal life God says I should tell you that in the next 72 hours a turnaround is coming in the name of Jesus Christ Amen, Amen. Somebody, a serpent has been programmed into your house to attack you. A serpent. You wake up in the next 24 hours and meet the serpent dead in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Jude. Jude. God says, as you pray for Jude. God says, Jude is wiping your tears. Heaven is wiping your tears. God is wiping your tears. God is wiping your tears. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Somebody is wearing a shirt. The whole top is black. But it's had an open button here. But it's pink. But the top most is crested black. There's an open button. But it's pink. And the Lord is showing me something that has been happening to your wife. He said the attack of the enemy on her ends today. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. So a lady in South America who has two children who have been booked for an operation. The Lord healed them now. I decree it is well with you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. So shall it be. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. You are sick in body. Put your left hand where you are ailing and hurting. Malade, votre and stretch your other hand towards et me. me vers moi. I command. Je command. You devil of sickness. Toi maladie. Spirit of infirmity. Esprit d'infirmité. Demon of attack. Demon d'attack. Come out in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Jesus. I decree be made whole. Soyez guéri complètement. From the crowns of your hair to the soles of your feet. De la tête jusqu'aux pieds. Jesus heal you. Jésus vous guérit. Jesus make you whole. Jésus vous guérit complètement. Jesus touch you. Jésus vous touche. Jesus set you free. Jésus vous libère. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Dans le nom Amen. de Jésus. It is well with you. In Jesus name. Amen. 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 The Lord bless you and the Lord grant your desires. In Jesus name. Let's take our Thank you for joining us in prayer. And may the Lord answer you according to your heart desires. In Jesus' name. Amen. Please do well to hit the like button and also subscribe for more.